Once you start using the Kurzweil 3000 assignment system, Kurzweil 3000 is tracking all of the work that's being done on those assignments. And there are a number of views that you can use to monitor and manage those assignments. Click on the Assignment button, and that brings up your Assignment List dialog. There are two levels of assignment views. One that's represented here with these three tabs gives you groups of assignments. When you select an assignment and click View Edit, that will give you assignment level information. such as the title and description, document information, and student information. In this clip, we're going to take a quick tour of many of these views, and we'll also show you a couple of things like customizing due date, accepting assignments, and responding to students. Let's go back to the current assignments view, and this is the one that shows you all of your current active assignments. The future assignments view will show you any assignments that you've been working on but you haven't assigned to any of your students. Past assignments are ones where all of the students have submitted their work and you as the teacher have accepted all of them. Let's go back to the current assignment view and take a look at the status. For this particular assignment, there were 11 students that were assigned it. One request is out there for you. Three students have started the assignment. Three are in progress. Three have submitted the assignment. And you've accepted two of them. The, the flag at the very beginning of the row indicates to you that there's a request or that there's another event that has happened. A student has started or submitted an assignment. To edit any of this information or to see the assignment level information, click on the assignment, click View Edit. The Assignment Information tab is read-only, and it gives you all the information that you had put into the assignment, plus the date that it was modified, the last date it was modified. In the Document Information tab, here you can see what document was associated with this assignment. You can add some more documents to it or remove documents. The Student Information tab gives you the most amount of information. The students that you assigned this particular assignment to, what class they're from, if there are any requests. So if you see a hand icon in one of those rows, it means that that student has asked you a question that you should be responding to. The status, the assignment begin date, and the due date. Let's say you have a student who's having trouble with this particular assignment. You can always change the due date for them. Double click on the cell. Just pick another date. You can also accept submitted work. Here's one. And just click the Accept button. And you can also respond to students' messages, or you can actually also add students and remove students. Here's your Add Student dialog. We can add Ann. And there she is. You can also remove students. So select the student and remove them. And you can respond to students who have requests out. So since Len has a request, click on that 
row and answer request. You get the log, type in your answer. and send. And that's pretty much it for monitoring and managing your assignments and students.